Whenever I go to Ralph's, Good and Plenty and Hot Tamales, which happen to be my two favorite candies, are always on sale and they're always blowing up their spot. Like there was a big display of like, we're trying to get rid of these. Can't, can't push these hard enough. <laughs> like I think it was like, buy five, get as many other ones free. And I was in, I got it, I bought them. <sighs> because I like them and I'm not ashamed. Finish the box of Good and Plenty today. And here's the thing. Like, people calling Scrabble a game. Like, I'm just tired of all the bull****, you know? Be like, my life sucks, and I'm lame, and this game gives me <sighs> half chub. Okay, because here's the thing. The Good and Plenty and Hot Tamales are always on sale. And it's embarrassing. They're never VIP or like, no, this is not, your Ralph's card won't give you a discount on these because these are top of the line. I like appreciate a sale, but it's not a sale when it's always on. Someone's lying. Someone's eating them. They're always on sale, but they're all, they're all still selling them there. And it's not just me. I mean, it could just be me. Hey, why all the drama? Why don't you just sell them and say, yeah, this is licorice covered in chalk. And some people like that. <laughs> but who are you to judge? You play Scrabble and call it a game. If you're eating them, just admit it so we could all just come together and have an us too moment and just eat weird candy and hold hands and just think of all the Halloweens we, we threw out that candy because we didn't want our friends to make fun of us. Where we could have just been pounding that black licorice. Is there other colors? Yeah, there's red licorice. That just sounded aggressive. <laughs> Sucking that black all Halloween long. We could have just crushed it, man. We could have had our own group. Been like, you eat your Twix. I don't know what they ate. Or cool candy. We're gonna eat black licorice and hot tamales. Cause our mouths are dangerous and our costumes are average. <laughs> I like peanut chews and I love, I love circus peanuts. Oh, you don't like them? I don't care. Then fill up my bag. But no, back then it was like, oh God, God forbid. This ugly motherfucker is never gonna be no body in life. No body. He's not gonna have a physical form later in life. He's gonna think badly of me because I have Oh, no. What's an orange circus peanut just glued to the roof of my mouth because I have no idea what they're made of but they never quite leave your mouth they're like chewy but then as you chew them and they get wet it's like soggy but then at the same time that makes them sticky maybe that's why they're called a circus peanut because you're like doing a trick with your mouth it's like how do you ever swallow it we never know it's there until it's not but it feels like it never left it's like mushy it's like a marshmallow but staler so you get a little bit of like a toughness also like good and plenty advertises so appropriately like pop chips you might as well call them this bag is mostly empty that'd be more honest i wouldn't mind if you're like you're buying two chips i'd buy two chips and then i'd buy 20 more bags or i wouldn't get them at all but when you open a bag of pop chips, all the air goes out and there are literally two sad chips at the bottom. Like we're healthy, never fried, only baked. Like that's not fun. Pop chips are selling a load of air, garbage. Anyway, good and plenty. They, they say they're good. You know, it's good. It's not great. Whatever amount you have, it's plenty. Boom, nailed it. You ever had a payday? That's just a lie in your mouth and you don't deserve that. You're spending your payday on a goddamn candy bar that's making fun of you. You're like the Milky Way. Like the only Milky Way is the one coming out of your <laughs> later tonight. <laughs> My cat has left the room. <laughs> He's like, this QQ Cray Cray Banane is probably gonna eat me. And I would, cause he looks tasty as f Sometimes I picture my cat taking off his tuxedo just being like so naked and then I walk in he's like oh god because like whenever I walk into a room they look like they were like just doing something or sort of like uh interrupted or embarrassed or like shocked and I always think they were like taking off their outfit and they don't want me to see like old housewives you know they were always like done up and perfect and like their hairs and curlers and everything was like a charade that's a fun game can you imagine you just unzipped it and he's like ah and it was just like a naked man cat because he's a boy not like that that would be more shocking than if it was a naked lady cat. But my cats ain't ladies. They're dogs. Literally, where was I? Oh, good and plenty. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just, I'm just not ashamed anymore. And I want more people to feel like they can come to me. 
You can see me in my office. <laughs> and my sister was visiting recently and I was like, oh, good and plenty. And I said it and then I was like, oh my God, I don't know if she knows that. Like I this lie has been kept for so long. And then she was like, yeah, let's get them. And I was like, what, 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 what? Are we related? And then I was like, she's probably making fun of me because the PTSD from my childhood just like <laughs> took over. And I was like, no, let's not get them. Don't bother with this garbage. And she was like, why? I like them. And I was like, me too, not what? So hard to get a read. No, but she did, she wanted them, she liked them, we shared them. <laughs> really connected. My dad can tell me I'm adopted as much as he wants, but we, m me and my sister are f from the same parents, whether it's him or not. So if you like a creepy candy, tell me and I will never make fun of you. What are the caramel ones I ate? Uh, the ones I bought that were also on sale? You know what I'm talking about? Milk duds. They're called milk duds. Cause they're duds. They're like so chewy, man. Like- They're malted milk balls. Mal no, that's Whoppers. I love Whoppers. It's like eating drywall. It's so good once they get wet enough and it's sort of all crumbled. Like you can taste like the paint or whatever it used to be. And it's so dry. It's so dry. They didn't even try to make a tasty sweet treat. They get, it's rough and tumble. I know I'm right. You don't have to tell me that. <laughs> I was born this way. Leave it to a man to be like, let me just make you feel more wrong by telling you you're right. The bitch was just my thing. I love when people call me a bitch because it's like, you get me. You see me for who I am and you acknowledge me. <laughs> Where were we?